a home first. I, I went away from this because the touch was just like not behaving properly. So let me um, bring it up. Looks like it should work. <laughs> I did the right thing. I'll just take a second to load here. So again, it's um, with with wired. Um, nice. Again, we this is based on Adobe Air, so it's you know basically like Flash outside of the browser. And so the Condé Nast guys basically say, okay, publishing can change when we go into the digital format. And so one of the things that they realize is, hey, when you pick up a magazine, you don't necessarily go page one, page two, page three, like you would in a book, right? So it makes sense for e-reader. Um, but you want to basically be able to preview your, your, your magazine first. So, they, so they've done kind of a mock-up of the Wired magazine where you can do a preview of the magazine Right, and then you could basically say, okay, I want to look at this ad. Actually, I meant to uh, <clears throat> click on this article, and then you can, uh, okay, take a look, sorry, take a look at the article. Which way did I go? There we go. And then All basically you, you read that, yeah. right? And obvious, obviously, if it's multiple pages, you can just kind of scroll up and down, but. The other, you know, the other thing is that w when it's digital content, you can also do more contextual things. Like I've got an advertisement here for VW. I should be able to have like either 3D model, so I can kind of take a look at it, interact with it, or a video of it in action, or references to local, you know, dealers that uh, would be more than happy to set up a test drive. <laughs> totally. Um, uh, you know, they're uh, you know they're putting together some premium content, and with that more interactive. You know, or or um, more visual kind of capabilities that they can put into this. It helps you to describe your product better, or tell the story, you know, in a better uh, new way. And again, it's it's you know kind of like taking full advantage of the digital transition instead of just doing a 2D thing. You know, really, really, um, uh, I think they're they're got some great ideas of how the, how they how they can take advantage of the new uh, medium. Finally, right. <laughs> um, Let's see, so one of the other, we got uh, we had another game here. Let's see how this uh, pans out. So Liz was in the next room. She said, I love this game. Nice. It's, you know, pretty simple, but there's like a ton of Flash games that are out there. So again, it takes advantage of our GPU, and you know, so it's all pretty, well, that's not a good square to hit. That's a good square to hit. You know, whatever, it's pretty simple. 